The game's future stars are on display as minor league baseball comes your way on the show. Opening night here in this brand new season between the Jackson Generals and the Chattanooga Lookouts. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. Hunter Green gets the call to pitch here on opening day in front of the hometown crowd. What's your take on him, Dan? Hey, we're looking at a guy that knows how to pitch. Last year, his ERA was just under 3.5 for the season. And I would imagine going into the offseason, he's looking to better that. And that hopefully, he gets off to a the good Jeffrey. start. And we'll see if that starts in this one today. Okay. Bottom of the second here with no score. Reaches one, one, out for one. one and hits it on the ground to second. Throw to first oh. will get him easily, and the side is retired. So nothing happening this time around. We'll go now to the top of the third. And we are tied nothing-nothing. Stepping in, Vaughn Harris. Here. As he'll get his first pitch. opportunity in this Whoa. one. Drive that pitch. Oh, here Harris. We go. for a good one, huh? He's ready. Now the pitch. And this is on the ground to short. Could be two. Come on, you to can second beat it. You for can one. Beat it. Oh. On to first, and they get the double play. That's not the guy you're going to see doubled off very often, so that was a quick turn at second base. Good transfer and a strong throw. Digging in. Bo Way. Leading up for the lookout. The center fielder. The 2-2. Two -two. Way. For second. One. one. He's got it. And there's He's one out. away. Digging in now. Charles Cruz. Batting it. The first baseman. Charles. Sent on the ground one, one, out one. to second. Scooped up. Throw gets him, two down. Now batting, Chris Oakey. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. This game pulling right along as we move into the middle innings with no score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on and get him in, but that hasn't been the case. Well, you know, he had a good idea right there. The infield was playing back, but it's not going to work out for him this time. That's now a nice play to react, the and they take fielders. care of him at first. Whoa. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. This one, is on one. the ground over to first. Oh, it takes a nasty hop, and he's unable to haul it in. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. In now, Vaughn Harris comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Harris. Get your pitch up there, huh? First pitch of the at bat on its way. High and deep to left. This one's got plenty of distance. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. And a big moment for him there. His first home run as a double-A player. Yeah, and you always like to get those first out of the way, no matter what level you're playing at. Obviously, he's got aspirations to play in the big leagues, and this is exactly the kind of production that this organization is going to be looking for from him as his career progresses. Ready to take his hacks now again. Vaughn Harris. Baseman. As he'll look to follow Whoa. up the two-run homer really? he launched over the wall last time up. Hey, have a rip up there right now, and huh? maybe trying hey. to get him off stride at the plate so he'll step out and ask for time. Here's the first pitch to him. And he fouls this one off. Hey, drive that pitch, huh? Here you go. Hey, get a good one up there, huh? Oh, and one. Here it comes. High fly ball out to straightaway center. 
And he will run this one down. A good read off the bat for the second out. Stepping in, Vaughn Harris. He'll start things out here in a tie ball game. Harris. And every pitch so crucial in a tie ball game, so he'll step out and ask for time. Let her fly, let her fly right here. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. Now a shot toward the gap in left center. You got it. Round it. Around first. He's digging for second. Arms pumping. He's hustling Come for on, third. Get out. The relay. And he's hey, in at third base job. with nobody out representing the go-ahead run. Other than a home run, there aren't a whole lot of better ways to start an inning than a triple. Pretty good chance of at least getting one run in this inning now. Jack Larson will come off the bench in a great RBI spot as he's got a runner at third here and nobody out. Go ahead, runs in scoring position here with nobody out. Looking good, no one better up there. Here you go. He pulls this one into right. Beltre has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. And the throw comes in, and they will not try sending him as that go ahead run remains at third with one away now. So the batting order turns over now and set to go now Alec batting. Thomas. And, and clearly this is a critical Alec. moment in this ball game. Go oh. ahead run at third with He's one away. Right Fastball laid off Looks well right. below the knees. Well this is a strikeout situation but it's also a ground ball situation. I hey, expect we'll right see here. a lot Let's of go, pitches kid. down in the zone trying to prevent the hitter from getting the ball up in the air. And there's out number two. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Galley Cribs. His day at the plate hasn't amounted to much. 0 for 4. But this is a great opportunity to make amends. Well, when your team really needs you like they need it right here, you have to be able to put your personal struggles out of your mind. Right now is all that matters. We need you. Here we go. To two balls and two strikes now. Don't be surprised if he gets another back foot slider right here. Don't think for a second, just because he took the first one, that this pitcher won't come back exactly the same way. And he strikes him out here for out number three. So after a scoreless top half, they'll have a chance to win it here in the bottom half. So no runs here on a base. Striding into the box, Charles Cruz. He's got a chance to end this one and send these fans home happy if he can get a ball deep enough into the gap. First. Throw to second for the force out, and the side is retired. So no runs on a hit here, no errors, one man left on. No winner yet. On to inning number 11 we go, and we are tied 4-4. Every game has its offensive stars, and in this one, he arguably shined the brightest. He's our top player of the game. Well, everyone wants to get their season off on the right foot and the feel like all the hard work in the offseason and the spring training has paid off. He came out here excited to play a real game again, and he really had a great game. The stars of tomorrow get their shot in the limelight today as the show's coverage of the Southern League is on the air. Time for game two of the regular season between the Jackson Generals and the Chattanooga Lookouts. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Nick Lodolo will be on the bump for game two of the series. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Well, as you can see, he's a tall drink of water out there, especially on the mound. That can really work to your advantage because you work on more of a downhill plane and you typically get more extension to the plate on your release. The key, though, is that he has to be out front with his release point or he'll be more that likely to miss up in the zone. The second baseman. Garcia, a runner at first with that one gun in the inning. Runner. He's running. Chopper up the middle, fielded cleanly. 
And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. Now to the plate, the pitcher, Nick Lodolo. And a chance now to increase his lead if he can deliver something here with two gone. Come on, fellas, let's go. First. Reined in. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. So all in all, they're fortunate to give up just three in the inning as they wind up escaping the bases loaded jam. We'll go on to the top of inning number two. Chattanooga leads it here three to nothing. Hey, let's now go, with the plate, Vaughn right Harris. Here. It was a two-hit effort for him, including a home oh. run in last night's game. Harris. Hey, wait for a good one and drive it. I'll pick one out. Here's the first pitch to him. There's a swing on, and a go, missile out. sent out. out to center field. A ball that's carrying. And he makes a nice catch on the track as that ends the inning. One more look at the final out. A teeth rattler if ever there was one. We're back to Friday Night Baseball on the show after this. So here's the cleanup hitter, Tyler Callahan. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Bunt his way on as he gets this one down. And he'll step on first for the out, three unassisted. Well, you know, he had a good idea right there. The infield was playing back, but it's... So digging in now, Chris now Oakey. The catcher. Chris Oakey. He's ready. Here's the 0-1. Bounce two, to two, first. Two, two, two. He's got it. There's one. Out. Relay to first He's in out. time. And just like that, this side is retired. One hit in the inning, but that gets erased. Three innings complete. The lookouts lead it 3-1. Hey, let her rip. Let her rip. Ready for another chance? Vaughn Harris. He flew three. out in his last oh. at-bat. Harris. Come on, let it fly right here. Let it fly. Here's the first pitch to him. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And it's a foul ball. The 0-1. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. And that is off the wall. And he'll coast into second here with a two-out double. That's what good hitters do. You get a pitch you like, and you just explode on it. He blasted that one over the left fielder's head for an easy double. Now batter, the pitcher, Josh Green. One and two now as that one's fouled off. And it's two balls and two strikes now. You certainly know he's not trying to work around the pitcher. But sometimes hey, the hardest rip, thing to do rip. is to throw a strike to a guy that you know won't swing the bat. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. Well, he really needs to make this guy swing the bat right here. He's not the type of hitter you want to dance around with. Here comes the payoff pitch. And he lays off here. It's ball four. And that is really cause for concern as he's just walked the opposing pitcher. Well, when you go with a the slider there in a full count, you're hoping that the hitter is thinking fastball and swings through it. Didn't work out that way, though. He lays off and gets the free pass. Alec. Three to one is our score here in inning number four. Fouled away. Hey, let it rip one time. And a good take there. Close, but it's two and two. Hey, 90 feet anyway, kid. Here we go. And it's fouled away.
fly ball out to straightaway right. Come on, dig, 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 go hard. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. No runs, a hit, two left. To the bottom of inning number four we go. Chattanooga leads it here, three to one. Stepping up now, Jamison Hanna. He sets to lead us Ooh, off in the home half of the out. fourth inning. The right fielder, Jamison. The 2-2. Swing and a ground one. ball to third. One. Scooped up. And that's out number one. So striding forward now, Charles Cruz. The first baseman, Charles Cruz. On the ground, out to second, reined in. Throw on to first, two gone. Next to hit will be the pitcher, Nick Lodolo. Now 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Nick. Here's the 0 1 pitch. And a bunt for a base hit here as he gets this one down. Throw not in time, and that'll go as a bunt single. Digging in and looking for more, Vaughn Harris. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Put a good swing on it. Here we go. First delivery to him on the way. Fly ball out toward left center field. Center fielder giving chase. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. Ready for another shot now. Jose now Garcia. It. We'll see if he can come through in a clutch Jose. spot here. Two on, two out here in inning number six. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. Harris has got it, and the side is retired. So it's a run on three hits, no errors, and two men left on. Seventh inning coming up. The lookouts lead it four to one. Digging in once again, Bo Way. He's two for three and looking for more here. The 2-2. Two -two. It hard to the right side. He's got it to second for one. The relay back to the pitcher, covering in time to double him up. Oh, that's a rally killer right there. They were in great shape with two on and nobody out, but the double play is the last thing you want in that situation. Just... Now at the plate, Vaughn the Harris. Base, number three. Vaughn. Hey, we need you right now. Here Harris. we go. Come on. One pitch. Here we go. Let's go. First pitch of the at bat. Line towards center field. Come on. You're scoring. You're scoring. You're scoring. Wade is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. Home half of the eighth straight ahead. 5-2 the final score tonight. The Chattanooga Lookouts jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Wyatt Strahan claims the win out of the pen his first. Five runs, 13 hits, one error, and 11 runners left on base. Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. Game number three of this new season between the Jackson Generals and the Chattanooga Lookouts. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. Coming to the plate now, Vaughn Harris. He'll stand in to open things up here in the third. Harris. First pitch on its way. Rolled slowly down the third baseline. He's got a hurry. Throw to first in time, and the leadoff man is gone to start the third. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And Ooh, that'll bring in the second out. baseman, Tyler Callahan. This game is right along as we move into the middle innings Callahan. with no score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on and get him in, but that hasn't been the case. 
Stepping into the box, Bo the Wang. Fielder, number three, Bo. On Wang. the ground to third. Fielded cleanly. And that's the oh. second out. At the plate, Vaughn Harris. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Vaughn Harris. Hey, you got it. No one better. Let's go. First pitch on its way. He's right there. One there. Deep, deep, on deep. to first oh. as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, T.J. Friedel will attempt to put the ball in play for a change here. Two guys going down on strikes to start the inning. Scooped up, they'll whip this one to first in time, and that ends the inning. Nothing doing here this half. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Tyler Callahan. He got on top of one and was a ground-out victim last time. Back up the middle four, four, and in four. for a base hit. The runner from second crosses the plate. It's a 2-0 ball game. So striding in, Bo Way. One in, Not one out, field. and Number one on three. here in the inning. Bo Way. Only hit to first. Two. I don't think they can get two. There's one. Out. Return throw is in time. How about that? They do turn two, and it gets him out of the inning. So it's one run on one hit, no errors, and no one left on base. We're through six full. The lookouts lead it two to nothing. Digging in, Chris Oakey. He'll be the man to lead things off here in the bottom of the seventh. The catcher. Here's the 0-1. Okay. Hard hit ball to second. He's got it. Throw to first oh. is in time for the first out. Now at the plate, Vaughn Harris. He'll start things out for us here in inning number eight. Starting to run out of time. They haven't been able to score any runs as we're moving late into this one. A perfect time for this leadoff guy to try to get on base and ignite a rally. No balls in one strike. And when a guy starts leaving the curveball up, that's a sign he's beginning to tire a little bit out there. He's got to be able to get on top of that pitch or he's going to start getting hurt. Yanked on the ground down the line. And there's his first base hit in this one. You know, yeah, yeah, there's been some right there. great pitching in this one hard. so far after that knock. That's only the third hit of the game, and we're getting late into this one. Yeah, they always say you got to tip your hat to the opposition sometimes. Well, I think this offense is tired of tipping its hat. They got to start to swing their bats a little bit better. That's their third knock of the game. I know it's late, but maybe they can get something going. Number 13. Both clubs with three hits in the ball game. Go, Runners go. off for second. That's Pitch is high. The throw. Not in time. He's in there at second. Keep it going. Your turn. Go. Here's the 2 1 home. That's ball three. Team's been struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. The 3 and 1 pitch. Is swung on and missed, and that's a full count now. Three balls and two strikes. When you get yourself to a 3-1 count and you get a fastball, those are the ones you really want to punish. Couldn't get the bat on it, so we'll see if that comes back to haunt him. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Center fielder on the run. He's there and records the first down. All right, hang on, hang on. Right there, right here. And he'll make it up to third safely here with one away. Ready once again, oh, Alec that. Thomas. The and as he bats, he represents Alec. the potential tying oh. run. Hey, need you now. Your turn, baby. Mine to the right side. But there to take this one is the second baseman, and that's out number two. Standing in, Galley Cribs, runner in scoring bat, position with two gone. Short guy, Galley Cribs. Just stand alive, putting together a really good at bat here. A man on third with two down. 
well outside with the curveball for a ball. So you'd love for him to offer at that one, but hey, right the execution guy, right was flawless. Nice curveball that starts in the zone and breaks just out. Just a great take by the batter. And here's a ball hit in the air. India has room in foul territory, and no one will track it down. You're lucky if you get one pitch a night right down the middle. Cannot be late on that fastball. Line drive snagged on a short hop. Throw in time, and the side is retired. So no runs here on a base hit, no errors, and one man left aboard. Home half of the eighth straight ahead. Chattanooga leads it here. Two. Well, this one had its moments of drama and excitement. In the end, these guys came away with the victory and the look on to the next one. Ball this ball evening's ball game finishes 2-0 the, the, the final two score. On three hits, no error. They left eight men on day. Ryan Atkinson enters to do the pitching, and best-case scenario for him is to push this one into extra innings. Well, we watched a really solid starting pitching performance, kept the opposition at bay, and as a result, he's our top player of the game. Well, I thought he did a real nice job on the mound, guys. He threw strikes and mixed his pitches really well. And in the end, his performance helped propel them to another victory. Pitching and defense game, 2-1, to one, the, final the final score this afternoon. Chattanooga came through when it mattered in the ninth on, on the way Indian. to the win. No Joel Kunell gets the win day. in relief, his second of the year. So that just about does it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make it. It's time for baseball now as the show's tour of the minors continues with a stop in the Southern League. Tonight, we've got a good matchup in store between the Jackson Generals and the Chattanooga Lookouts. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Tony Santion has the ball for the fifth game of the series. Dan, any thoughts? Well, Matty, if you're looking for innings out of your starting pitcher, you're looking at the right guy. This guy seems to deliver more often than not going deep into the games. He's one of those guys you feel really confident that could go into that seventh, eighth, and even the ninth inning. A workhorse. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Smoked on the ground left side. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm. A base hit. Sometimes you need a little luck. Sometimes you need to get a ground ball with eyes. And that's exactly what happened right there. That is it. The left fielder, Yasmani Tomas. Into the corner and slicing foul. bag and a dive but he's back here's the one two and an off speed pitch swung on and missed and with that the side is retired so they get to him for a couple of hits in the inning here but they've got nothing to show for it so it's on to the bottom of inning number one no score Now in the box, Charles Cruz. He's set to lead off the home half of the second. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff to get on and get a big inning started. But the throw will beat him at first, so the bunt for hit attempt is snuffed out. Well, you know, he had a good idea right there. The infield was playing back, but it's not going to work out for him this time. That's a nice play to react, and they take care of him at first. Batting so in. coming to the plate, the Alberti base. Chavez. Alberti. He'll get to take his first cuts here. 1-1. And there are two oh. away now. So here now is the pitcher, Tony Santion, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Cody. Short. Santion. Fielded cleanly. Throw in the He's dirt, out. but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. So they go quietly here in this half inning. 
We've played two full. Jackson leads this one three to one. Top of the third set to get underway. And next it'll be the fleet-footed first baseman, Vaughn Harris. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. This will kick up against the wall now. Come on, get out, get out, get out. And he'll get there as he kicks off the third oh, with a leadoff triple. Right there. So he's head first into third as he laid it all on the line on that one. Yeah, he took a pretty big risk going for the triple, Matt, but you got to love the aggressiveness and the willingness to get dirty and beat the throw to third. Man, that was a fun play to watch. Now batting, the left fielder, Yasmani Tomas. And this misses for ball four. The second walk he surrendered here in the first three innings. And as a pitcher, that's always tough. Looked like he got a bad break on some of those calls, but he's got to learn that sometimes the calls don't go your way and you've just got to move on. That's something that young pitchers can have a hard time with, though. Here we go, baby. Find a good The 1-1. One, one is strike two swinging one and two. with two strikes now and a runner at first do you go for the strikeout or you're still looking for the double play ball good time to try to put the ball down in the strike zone you can either get a strikeout or potential double play ball fly ball right down the line in left and that will end up a foul ball come on big guy come on buddy all right come on now one time let it fly and look out as that one ran in and got him well, as a pitcher, you never want to hit a guy, but he's been struggling early, and the hitters have owned the inside part of the plate, so maybe this will help him reclaim the inner half and start to become more effective. Has to command it in there, though. So stepping in, LT Tolbert. He could really open this lead up early if he can deliver here with the bases loaded. The 1-1. One -one. Hit in the air to center field way is there let's see if they try it and they'll tack on a run with the sack fly it's now a four to one ball game man this is a spot where you hey, next will be the cleanup hit. hitter Vaughn Harris already oh. two for two he'll look Harris. to add on right here hey your pitch get some wood on it Let it fly, big boy. Here we go. Here comes the first pitch. Fly ball hey, heading for the alley. Ball, go hard, go hard. And this is going to wind up as extra hard, bases as that'll play one for sure and maybe a second. And the runner will score from second. And he is in there. Wow, he's getting his daily conditioning in during the game. That's his second triple, so obviously he's seeing the ball great, and he's showing he knows how to motor around the bases just fine. Here comes the manager out of the first base dugout heading for the mound, and we're going to see a pitching change as that's going to do it for his starter here tonight. So as he leaves, I would imagine these fans would not be much pleased with his performance here this evening as he certainly was not sharp. And it's one and two. One ball, two strikes to count. See it, drive it, let's go, kid. Now about a 58-foot breaking pitch that he wisely lays off here. He might have to look for a different way to put this guy away on 2-2. He's already seen the curveball a couple of times, so he might be looking for it. We got a full, count. full count now, 3-2. and two. Dalton Varsho waits on deck. Hey, let's go, kid. One time, right here. And he misses ball, ball four. four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man he faces. And with first base open, the last thing he wanted to do was give him something to hit in the heart of the zone. So no harm done. Force out the anywhere now. Dalton Varsho. Hey, I brought that up there, huh? Three-two pitch inside as he nearly got him, and it's ball four. 
Now at the plate, LT Tolbert. He hits here in a spot where he might be able to now put this one out of reach. Yeah, oh, man. Geez. Down five. Another run Tolbert. across here could very well put the nail in the there. coffin. Mentally, they might still feel like they've got a shot if they can get out of this jam, though. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. Hey, have a rip like you can. Here you go. The 2 1. Fouled off. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Lifted down the line in left. Left fielder is on the move. He gets there and makes a fine running play for the second out. And he's out. Beautiful throw home to cut down the run. So it's two runs on three hits, no errors, and a couple of men left. On now to the bottom half of any middle. At the plate, Michael Beltre. Now batting, left fielder. Into the windup, here comes the 2-2 pitch. Fun for a base hit here as he gets this one down. And he'll beat the throw as he's got himself a bunt single. Into the box now, Charles Cruz. The first He's 0 for 1 thus far. Charles Cruz. 0 1, here's the pitch. Bunt attempt two. here as he gets this one down. To second for one, on to first, but not in time as he beats it out. Trying to pick things up where he left off. Vaughn Harris. He's looking to go four for four Harris. with a base hit right here. Right here, one time. Here we go. Here's the first pitch to him. And he fouls this one off. Two out, bases loaded. Hit hard down the left field line. But this is going to get foul. Hey, get a good one. Get a good rip on it, huh? Hey, like you can up Here there, comes the 0-2 pitch. Fly ball out to straightaway right go, field. Go, 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 Long run for the right fielder. He's got it. And they get out of the jam unscathed. At the plate, Jose Garcia. No hits to this now point. Short stop. Jose. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Pretty painless half of the inning. Into the box now, Chris Oakey. He's now one for two in the ball game. On for a base hit here as he gets this one down. Throw to first is in time, so a good idea, but the bunt attempt doesn't pan out. Now to the plate, Vaughn Harris. He the flew out eight. in his last at bat. Harris. Here we go, one time like a big dog. First pitch coming, here it is. Hey, Line drive, and that's going, a base going, hit into center field. Round it, round it, find the ball. And that's going to plate the runner from second, and it's now a 7 to 1 game. I mean, that had to feel good right there, Dan. That's his third RBI of the game and extends his team's lead. They might have this one locked up. Boy, I tell you, those are always big, those add-on insurance runs. Big RBI right there for a little bit more breathing room. Now batting. Settling in now, here's Money Tomas. He's 0 for 2 with a couple of walks in this one. Reaches down slide, and hits slide, this slide. one on the ground to short. Scooped come on, up D, come on to first, on. and that'll do it as they manage to not Ladies let this gentlemen. inning get Ladies out of George. hand. So one run here Ladies on... Gentlemen, your attention, please. Big hitting for the lookout. Number eight, Tyler. For a base hit here as he gets this one down. Off-balance throw gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. So no runs on a hit here, no air... Coming to the plate now, Chris Oakey. One in, one out, and one on here in the inning. Okay. The one-two. On the ground to second base, this could be two. One there, relay to first in time, and just like that, this side is retired. 
So one run on one base hit, the home run, one error in the inning, and no one left. We've played eight full. The Generals lead it eight to two. All set to start the ninth in this one. And stepping in will be the very fleet-footed Vaughn Harris. Here comes the first pitch. Now a swing and a fly ball. And it's a foul ball. 0-1, oh here's the pitch. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, it's gone. Nearly a big fly to start the inning instead of foul ball. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. There's a drive out to left center field. Round it. Around first, digging for two. And he's not stopping. He wants three. The relay throw. And he'll get there as he legs out the leadoff triple. That is now three triples for him in the game, which is darn near impossible. In fact, the last 15 years or so, only a few guys have done it. Pretty impressive what he's been able to do in this one. Now batting, left fielder, Yasmani Tomas. Hard hit ball to second, and that is into right field, a base hit. In to score is the runner from third, now a 9-2 ball game. Yeah, Matt, hard to stay focused on the game when the score is this far out of hand, especially when you're on the losing side of it. Even as broadcasters, it can be a little bit challenging to stay fully dialed in. Well, baseball is a game of streaks and runs, so a four-game skid happens to even the best of teams. The key is they didn't panic or press. They just came out here, played their game, and put the losing streak behind them like professionals are supposed to do. Well done. Fans Ten to two, the final in this game. Jackson were on fire Jackson with the bats generally. and ended Ten up with 19, 19 hits hit. total. Two Cole errors, Stapler gets the win on the mound, his first of the year. Tony Santion permitted six Four earned lookout. runs to come Two across in the losing hits. effort. No so that'll put they a wrap on things on here base. this evening. For my partners, Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a special presentation of MLB The Show. For more, follow us on Twitter at MLB The Show. And we remind you to please drive home safely. A double-A hitting coach touches base with a new arrival to the team.